if you just spare the moment, oh, oh I, mean, I want to plant something, yeah. you know, you could probably do it. <laughs> no! <laughs> it would so that well. was brilliant! <laughs> We've got here a, uh, a common shrub, the Berberus Darwini. What can you tell us about it? It's quite boring at the moment, mm. but also from the picture you can see it blossoms into a, into a beautiful plant. Mm. Thorny, you know, yeah. any animals coming in, moles, foxes, what have you, they pick on this, no chance. And I've got some quite hard wearing gloves, as you can see they've had a good life. Could you wear a goalkeeper glove for this if you didn't have these around? Ideally, if you've got time, you know, if you're not in a rush, go out and buy the proper, appropriate gloves, otherwise, you know, anything can happen. This is a thorny bush, mm. if you get your fingers on there, they could pierce the latex and, and you know, you'd end up with uh, quite a few pricks on your fingers. So for, for any emergency sort of planting, you know, you've got, you've got nothing around, then take the goalie glove, sure, but it's not ideal. It's not ideal, and especially, like I said, for a plant like this, if, you, if you're going to use goalie gloves, be prepared, maybe use two pairs. How big would this grow? Well, this will grow to six by seven foot, which, as you can imagine, is quite a sizable plant. Um, it's a grant halt by... A by John Ruddy. Oh, by, by John, John Ruddy, yeah. yeah. So it's fairly big. Yeah. Um, you know, but at the moment it's going to go in this size and it'll take 10 years to get to that sort of level. So we've got time. Yeah, no we've got panic. plenty of time. So hopefully, you know, I might have been moved out of this house and someone else can deal with the problem after that. Mm. People think, oh, there's a nice spot in the garden. Let's just put a plant there. Put no, the plant in, no. No, 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 no. You can't do that. Let's give it a water, I think shall we? The wa I think the water band's stopped so we yeah. should be okay i don't okay. want to get a fine for it because it'll come back to your front well, i'll tell you door, what I'll, I'll pop to the, you the tap turn, if you start yeah. what, what's that like pressure wise there john are you getting it no i'm not getting anything what do you what think the doing? problem here is john i've got an auto lock on it this is a real this is a dilemma flow, you really, see this is a dilemma is because this this stops you in your flow there we go i've already prepared a hole with a shovel just to get sort of depth and the width that we need mm. now it's just to find the details so what now it's surface just are you on here well, it's clay mainly, I do believe, and obviously we've got the bark as decoration on top of that. Reminds me of being at, you know, kids at school would have yeah, used this. Yeah, it's good fun, it's good fun. So yeah. Kids are bored, give them a trial, get them to dig there, clay with the clay. Now, how Place do you the judge the, the depth here? Because obviously you don't want to go too shallow. No, you don't want to go too shallow. It's, um, you know, you want it to be covered though. You know, probably a little bit too deep, if anything. So all you do, a bit, a bit, just stick that back in there. There you go. That's the beauty of nature, isn't it? There's, it is. no, there's no fine lines. Give it a little chop up, make yeah. sure you get it. Chop that up. Really need to be focused and dedicated on what you're trying to achieve. If you need to get hands on, you need to get hands on. You know, yeah. the garden is, is, is where the action's at. So when can we expect to see the first blossom, would you think? Springtime. Springtime, okay. I think, for this. You know, it might take a little bit longer because obviously we've planted it this time of year. Mm. Whether it's going to root in by spring, we'll yeah. never know. We'll have a wonderful plant with uh, very vibrant colours. Okay, well that's the Barber's Darwin, uh, as it were, uh, bedded. Thank you just so much, John, for your, your time and showing us how to do that. No problem.